Inner City Press has obtained and published a memo from UNSCO to Mr. De Serpasors, the legal counsel, asking for legal advice on whether to inform Israel and Jordan of possible misconduct by UN staff in Jerusalem, comma, Israel. And I wanted to know, get, I wanted, I'm going to be delicate because it's an allegation, right? But is it, has it been decided to inform these two governments of possible misconduct implicating uh, this, this extremely important uh, touch point? I'm not going to comment on, on a leaked document, let alone one I've, I'm not aware of. But do you think, what's, what's no, no, the I'm, standard? I'm not, How about I, what's I, the I, standard? I, Shouldn't I, the governments be informed of this, whether? I, 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 I'm not going to comment okay. on it. And Lightning round, yes. I just, uh, it, it, without, that, without that less, less, not less, needed is yet. That not less, needed, less value than the periscope we'll round? We'll see. We'll see, yeah. we'll see how things develop. Okay. But just one is, I, I just had I, this Western Sahara envoy question. It's getting stranger and stranger. How long has it been since there's been an envoy? And what is this, I guess at this point, what is the holdup? Uh, I'm not going to comment on your characterization. Um, when we have a personal envoy to announce, we will announce one. Okay. The, the, we have a deadline on it. The, Cameroon government has, is sending these three individuals. They mm -hmm. say it's there's a formal letter to Toma Monte saying they're coming to UN mm -hmm. headquarters. You'd said you'd check with the usual yeah. suspects. Have you heard? Uh, you yes, I will have probably more for you, more on that for you on Monday. Okay, and the, okay, and this is more this is an investigative question, but no no periscope needed. The last one has to do with the Yang Lapsang case, believe it or not. In the case, uh, among the the evidence that, that 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 came out leading to the guilty verdict was evidence. Of a, of a former uh, permanent representative of El Salvador, Carlos Garcia, assisting mm -hmm. Francis Lorenzo in getting mm -hmm. ill-gotten gains okay. released from the Dominican Republic. I've asked you about him before because since serving as a, as a permanent rep, he seems to be a kind of bridge to NGOs. He had an NGO called Global Governance for the UN SDGs. I still see him around 1B, squiring people around. So my request to you is given, and again, I don't know if OIOS tracked the case or not, given what was shown on the screen and put into evidence regarding his assistance in Mr. Francis Lorenzo getting bribe money released, does he have some, he has some kind of a pass. Is there some will, kind of happy, emeritus status happy, for I'm diplomats, happy. or how does it work? I'm not aware of any um, uh, emeritus. I'm emeritus, yeah, emeritus, yeah uh, emeritus status except for journalists, so I will look into it. Thank you.